Here's a recap of what I found yesterday. Okay. Here's that wire I was talking about. Super heavy. It's continuous batch, but definitely pretty heavy. Wow, it's really heavy actually. Yeah, it's easily 30 pounds between both of these. Actually quite heavy. Sort it out. Little dolly. Wherever it is. Big TV set. It's got aluminum sides, see? It's plastic here, but it's all aluminum here. We get a bag of bottles. Screen yesterday too. Didn't get a lot yesterday, but I don't know what you can do. It's not up there. I do find some big stuff after, but it's just too late. I have to go to Burnaby, drop a check off, so or drop a report off, pick a check up. And then what I'm, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick up the hot water tank if it's still there. And that uh well, I think it was a washing machine. Here's that bumper, I think it's a Volkswagen. Hmm. 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 Two, two brass pieces here. It could be a Volkswagen, it's kind of pretty narrow. Volkswagen bug, I'm thinking, but it could be wrong. That's metal. Hmm, sounds like metal, but. It could also be hard plastic. That hard plastic is really hard to tell. If I strip that one, it's got aluminum here. I'm thinking.
Things are so heavy. And I'll strip this one later. Panasonic. A nice day today, so let's get my uh, shred ready. Clean all this up, hopefully. Here's the big fuse box. I'm not sure if it's gonna be copper or not. Nice copper there, look at that. These are all copper, those three. Wow. I'm gonna strip anyways. We'll see what I get out of it. But that's nice copper right there. It's probably a pound of copper there. That heavy duty copper. Yeah, I'm going to unload the rest of this, you've seen pretty well what, what I have. Fans and stuff. Just a few pots here and there. Okay. Lamp here. Looks like it's a pot metal. Sometimes that's brass. This pot metal here. You have, to, you have to look at your. It's the same as aluminum. But a little bit lower grade, a little bit lower price, but. So that's okay. Probably two or three pounds here. So it made a better day because uh, what they do is it's a lower grade it's like uh, 50 cents when the, I'll get 65 and that'll be like 50 cents and the same thing is like this stuff here too well this is probably steel Put these little inserts here. See the inserts here? If I can get it off, these two little inserts. See the little stick. See right here. It's like die cast. Zinc. zinc. These cutters are actually pretty good at Home Depot. 
They cut nice. I don't like the other one, just doesn't cut. Brand new, they don't cut. These ones cut really nice. This is uh, stainless here, aluminum, but one bottom has steel on there. It's all steel, a little wire. So let's put all it. Okay. Yeah, I showed you guys before, but uh, crazy lights like this. Just go like this. See that? We just come off. See that? It's no effort. And you'll have, you'll have decent wire. Still like a lower grade, but still pretty decent. Yeah. See? Really good. Oh, that one cut. This one might be a little different. Yeah, this one's a little different. This one's between seams. This one is doesn't go like that. But these vintage ones, no problem. And this being old wire, it's a lot thicker. Thicker than normal, you know what I mean? So you might even be able to strip it. of the stuff in my yard. It's a matter of getting it processed. The wire is high right now so I might do this box after. I leave my plug-ins on, they don't see nothing, so... I don't know how the new yard's gonna be, but... See, it's dripped dirty, pretty quick. Now you can process, see? Throw in regular cables. I'll strip this after. This one, you have, you have to cut the sides off because it's pressed in between. Okay? Tank. I think that washing machine is gone. Oh, it's heavy. Oh. Yeah, let's see the washing machine. I'm gonna put a wedge in there, otherwise. He's gonna break my truck apart. I just don't know whether I saw a wash machine there, but uh, well, I didn't see it there, but I see some other stuff there. Same location, but it's in the yard. At least this is here. 
So, I have to go back and try to find that. I know where it was, it's gone. I know my area is pretty good. But there's some more metal sitting in the guy's yard. I'm trying to see if I can see someone home. Okay. Couple chairs here. Mm, pretty good weight, actually. At least if I can uh, jam up the stupid thing. It keeps banging. It keeps banging everything. So I grab the truck, heading back now. It's actually pretty heavy. Yeah, it's a pretty good weight. Nope, there's water coming out of it. Nice looking, but it's a lot of glass. Get around. Oh, yeah, very heavy. I'm worried about the glass. I grabbed the chair over there, I knew there was something here. I wasn't sure, you know, you see stuff from distance. And you look at it thinking, huh, you know, maybe this is... I can't believe it. Can't believe that one. See, different area, right? Vancouver's kind of dried up. So, just do another area. Okay. I was hoping to get a dishwasher because it would probably fit here. But, uh, never know. 
Got a little more driving to do. Every chair. Of course, the car has to come behind. I don't know if I let the chair fit here. Let's pull over. It's heavy. I just don't like that material and but it's shreddable. I mean, what do you do? Shred a shred, I guess. Who knows what will pop up? That's the thing. This one's really heavy. I get rid of this, maybe. Nope. This one's really heavy. I rip the sides off it. Pick up these screws. This one is flat tire. Like 20 pounds, these two pieces. A couple more pieces of metal here. Hardly worth stopping, but you know, that's what it is. never know what pops up, right? I'm in Burnaby right now, another part of Burnaby. Just never know. Okay. Okay, so it's gonna be a uh, stainless steel. Bit here a second ago, like this. So back at the yard now. Not sure if that fits or not, but hmm. this might be aluminum. That's stainless, but this is aluminum. Got a hex key on it. Take off the front too. And skin it. Yep. Stainless steel is more shiny, and if you handle enough of it, you can tell. This 
like extruded almost. Yeah. You listen to the difference. See the stainless steel? See the difference? One sounds really hollow. Perfect. Ah, usually it's stuck on there so good you can't get it off. Fluked out on this one. So another handle. Happy about that. Usually they're glued on there so good. It's a nightmare to try to get it off. That's why a lot of times I try leaving it on there. It's too hard to get off. That's aluminum too. It's a good value here on this one. A bunch of screws on the bottom of that thing. So you have to keep your eyes out. These stoves. Let's get a garbage shaft there. Okay, so I'm going to take the back off. It's got a good lot of wire. It's a nice part about these things. Try to find the right bit here. Good here. This didn't work too good. Okay, it might work. It doesn't fit that great, but let's see what happens. As you can see. Nice amount of wire. Good. Not bad. Transformer. A little more to here, a little more to there. this one here okay I'm gonna strip this one down we got all this big harness out of there lots of wire couple pounds of wire probably this one's really good 
good for value. So pretty good value. Got two handles of this. This is stainless steel. Yeah. These two handles. They're pretty decent. You know the garbage can and start putting stuff in the garbage can. I think this will be different than the other stuff. This one's extruded. I don't know if they paid much difference, but they may. Okay, that one's stripped. So I'm just gonna move stuff over. Um, gotta figure what's uh, actually. I grab that garbage can again, and I just want to put some aluminum and copper and stuff for now. Garbage can here. Pretty heavy, probably steel. Like copper. Not sure what it is. Hmm. Okay, let's peel that. It's aluminum. Tell. It's heavy, but it's uh, you can tell it's just different. Heavy steel. It's gonna add up pretty good this weight. It's aluminum. I'm gonna strip that one. And it could be sellable still, but it's for raking gravel and stuff. Well, these are actually cast. That's weird. Hmm. I would trust cast on any kind of weight, to be honest.
levels. Maybe sellable. I'm not sure what's in here. Brass. Yeah, it's brass. Keep the brass separate. Stainless or steel? Steel. Hmm. Just uh, make an area here and just put stuff in there. Okay. Not steel, it's way too heavy. Okay. Okay, this is aluminum here. It's tubing. Nice and clean. And all this is just, uh, aluminum here too. It's pale. That was about 25 pounds probably. 20 pounds for sure. Just to be safe. Okay. next um, so we got this on a pickup too this wire Okay, so I'll strip this next thing here. Okay, okay this is still that came out of my, my rental property. It's pretty burnt. They said, uh, I don't know, they said they had a toaster plugged in here, plugged in here, but there's something that was on here also. Right, see it's burnt here. That's something on here. Who knows, they could have had the element, this going on in the toaster here. I, I don't know, but... Anyway, in any event, it's burnt to crap. Well, the fire department deemed it accidental, so... so what's that mean? It's your fault? I don't know what this one is. I've never seen that before. Bunch of relays here. Don't know.
some more to here. Let's take out the uh, Drill. So get closer one. Right here. Okay, well I'm gonna take off that relay box. I've never seen it before. Never seen that box. seen one before. Okay, so Okay, so I'm gonna stick that in there and I'm gonna stuff it. I think this is it for this portion of the video. It'll run too long otherwise. So I just gotta keep loading the bin up. Okay, thanks for watching. If you liked my uh, entertainment, make sure to share with your friends. As always, thanks for watching. Have a good day.